Welcome back to the Famous Room channel. If there's one thing you can count on, it is 90 Day Fiancé delivering unlimited entertainment, riveting drama, and interesting real-life stories. These stories are sure to keep you glued to your TV screen, however for the couples featured on the show, it's all too real. They're putting it all out there for a chance at laugh or a green card. They're opening themselves up to public scrutiny and judgment. 90 Day Fiancé gives us a peek into strangers' ups, downs, joy and sadness. The individuals featured on reality TV lose their privacy, and sometimes information that they may not want to be public gets out. For 90 Day Fiancé couples like Anfisa and Jorge, this is their reality. The couple's relationship was frayed from the get-go, but being in the public eye probably contributed to the decline of their marriage. 10. Jorge lied to Anfisa about his finances At first glance, Jorge never seemed like a lovesick man, smitten with his lady. Well, he was, but he also told a lot of lies. Anfisa is a woman with expensive tastes, and in order to get her attention, Jorge embellished a little. He was not truthful about the state of his finances. It turns out the 90 Day Fiancé star didn't have the kind of money he claimed to have, and his new bride did not receive the news well. 9. He did his criminal past When 20-year-old Anfisa moved across the globe to be with Jorge, she had envisioned a lavish lifestyle, residing in a mansion, enjoying shopping sprees, and having enough money to throw around. However, that was not going to be the case. Due to Jorge's criminal history, which he'd initially kept hidden from Anfisa, he had trouble getting approved for a lease and the pair resorted to living in hotels. For someone with considerable debt and bad credit, living in hotels was costly. 8. Anfisa wasn't in it for love Love or hate her, Anfisa Nava is a woman who knows what she wants and isn't afraid to say it. Critics labeled her a gold digger and accused her of marrying Jorge for financial gain. She wanted a $45,000 wedding gown and acted entitled during the first stages of their marriage. It's not surprising that people felt she wasn't in love with Jorge at all, but in her defense, he did promise her a lavish lifestyle. 7. Jorge also lied about the legality of his marijuana business. When we were first introduced to Jorge Nava, he seemed mysterious and shady. His Mr. Moneybags persona had many people wondering how he really made his money. As per In Touch Weekly, Jorge previously revealed that he makes a lot of money as a medical marijuana entrepreneur. It was later revealed that Jorge's medical marijuana business was not legal. 6. Anfisa's violent outbursts were caught on camera When Anfisa learned that Jorge wasn't as wealthy as he had let on, that mean the lifestyle she'd expected to live wasn't going to be possible. What ensued were violent outbursts directed at Jorge, she even keyed the word idiot on Jorge's car. Viewers witnessed her verbally abuse him. At some point, her outbursts got physical. Anfisa hit Jorge on 90 Day Fiancé as viewers watched in horror. 5. Jorge's arrest took a toll on their marriage As earlier discussed, Jorge Nava's medical marijuana business wasn't legal and it wasn't long before law enforcement figured out what he was up to. He was busted with nearly 300 pounds or 136 kilograms of marijuana and sentenced to two and a half years in prison. That most certainly took a toll on Anfisa and Jorge's marriage. The pair had a tumultuous marriage before, and Jorge's sentencing was the final blow. 4. They grew apart after that Anfisa had no friends nor family in the United States, and she moved halfway across the world to be with Jorge. He was her source of livelihood and his prison sentence mean that she had a lot of growing up to do. Their time apart did not bring warm feelings of fondness for the pair, it did the opposite. The pair grew apart. Anfisa enrolled in college and participated in fitness competitions, which changed the public's perception of her. 3. Jorge decided to live a healthier lifestyle while behind bars some positives certainly came out of Jorge Nava's time behind bars, he decided to embark on a healthier lifestyle. The 90 Day Fiancé star lost a total of 128 pounds, or 58.06 kilograms, and claims the attention it brought him made Anfisa jealous. He further accused her of cutting all communications with him and abandoning him. Whatever the case, the weight loss was great for Jorge, it gave him a confidence boost. 2. Anfisa didn't want to be married to him anymore. 
Anfisa had intended to stay by Jorge's side and make it work during his incarceration, according to In Touch Weekly, the 90D fiancé star revealed. However, the whole time I felt like I had a weight on my shoulders that wouldn't let me be happy. I knew I had to end it and it would be better for both of us, so Jorge and I talked about it and mutually decided to part ways a few months ago and agreed to divorce once he's released. 1. Jorge is a free man and is ready to move on with his life. After serving more than two years of his prison sentence, Jorge Nava was released a couple of months early due to good behavior. Now a free man, Jorge is ready for a fresh start. Anfisa seems to have moved on and the pair have both expressed their desire to pursue a divorce. It's probably the best option for them, seeing how tumultuous their marriage has been. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.